Um, one really good tool that I like to use in this is by SAS Capital, and they have uh, called the SAS Capital Index that they use and um, a calculation behind it. I actually created a little tool that does an instant SAS valuation based off of their models on my site that if you want to check that out, you can do it. But essentially what, what people are looking at there is a, uh, the growth of the business and the net revenue retention of the business. And so those are the two primary factors that um, are kind of considered when you're talking about a larger uh, SaaS business. On the lower end of the scale, so if you're talking about smaller businesses, most of those are done based on what's called seller's discretionary earnings, which is kind of your EBITDA uh, plus any sort of ad backs that are really just, you know, seller uh, benefits. Think about, you know, their salary, their health insurance, their phone, their, some people are putting their cars through these things, right? There's a lot of other things, um, owner benefits that people are adding on to that that we take a, a detailed look at to understand what is the real cash flow of the business. And usually you're gonna see a multiple on that cash flow, um, usually in the ballpark of, you know, four, five, six times uh, those types of discretionary earnings. And then as the business grows and you get over that million, $2 million ARR mark, now you're talking about forward looking ARR multiples. And um, if a business is relatively flat or plateaued, you're going to talk about maybe one to two times ARR. And if the business is growing, then, um, you know, as the model uh, that I use in that calculator will show, it's kind of in that four to five, six times uh, earnings and, or not earnings, I'm sorry, annual recurring revenue, ARR, um, for the larger SaaS businesses. So there's kind of like this split in the market in terms of the, the buyers and how they typically uh, value the businesses. And it's on the lower end, it's primarily off of earnings. On the higher end, it's typically ARR. 